Atlanta Regional Commission Chairman Tad Leadhead addressed Cobb County business leaders and elected officials at the Cobb Chamber First Monday Breakfast, sharing a historic plan that could go a long ways towards solving one of the region's biggest challenges, traffic congestion. In 2012, citizens will have the opportunity to vote for a penny sales tax to fund sweeping transportation projects throughout a 10-county region that will cut commute times, offer commuters mobility choices in peak travel times, and improve our quality of life. If the referendum passes, it will be the largest single transportation infrastructure investment in the history of Metro Atlanta and Georgia. This will reduce traffic. This will provide people with transit choices in addition to their single occupancy vehicles. And frankly, it'll simply move people faster around the region. So less traffic, shorter commute times, more predictability of traffic simply means that people will be able to get to their jobs faster, people will be able to get home to their kids' games faster, and businesses that are concerned about the traffic in Georgia and in the region will know that our traffic is improving and therefore give greater consideration to relocating their business here to Atlanta. The transportation splost is poised to be one of the largest economic development drivers and infrastructure investments in the nation. If passed, over $6 billion of new transportation funds will be generated over 10 years, with all funds raised in the Metro Atlanta region staying in the Metro Atlanta region. If you look at where we are right now without a T-Splus, this is pretty much what we have. We're, we're stretching the dollar as far as we can, just like people in their personal budgets and business budgets. We at the state agency at GDOT and our employees are doing a great job of stretching that dollar and being more efficient. But if we're going to make that step forward, and people see something in Georgia, our population's increased to 9.7 million, so they see an opportunity here. We need to fulfill the needs of mobility, whether it's people mobility or freight mobility. We need to look at all projects and, and it'll move our state forward, so it's, it's very positive. Currently, county commission chairs and mayors from all 10 counties are meeting through a regional roundtable to develop the transportation project list. This list includes everything from new interchanges, bridges, road and highway widening, high capacity rail, pedestrian and bike paths, and more. Well, it's all about jobs and quality of life. We have companies that have decided to relocate out of the Atlanta area, companies that are not coming here because of our uh, tremendous congestion. We have families that can't get together for dinner every night. We have mothers that can't get to the ball games, fathers that can't get where they need to be in the evenings. And the congestion is overwhelming the, the city and we need to do something about it. The Cobb Chamber has been a leader in advocating for this proactive and historic measure and urges residents to educate themselves on the region's transportation funding crisis and be part of the solution by voting in the upcoming referendum. Well, I think the reality that we face if the transportation splash doesn't pass is we're going to see another, at least another decade of gridlock and transportation traffic congestion, which diminishes not only the individual's quality of life, but it also hurts our ability to recruit and retain businesses here in Metro Atlanta. Atlanta, Georgia, and our region, including Cobb County, were built on, a, on a, being a transportation hub and attracting the best businesses from around the country. In the 1980s and 1990s, everybody wanted to move to Atlanta, Georgia, because it was a great place to live. Traffic congestion is a major issue when it comes to quality of life and we need to do something about that and this vote in 2012 will actually allow us to address traffic congestion in a holistic way so that we don't just put as we call it uh, patchwork on potholes. We actually do major logistical transformation of our transit and transportation system. It would break the gridlock. It would allow for commerce to flow through in and around uh, Cobb County and the Atlanta, Georgia region. We'd all have a better way of life. For more information on the impact of the transportation splost on the region's economic development assets, visit www.AtlantaRegionalRoundtable.com. For more information on how the Cobb Chamber is working to strengthen our community and region through pro-business public policy like this, visit www.CobbChamber.org.